working on my Dell R710 build of a VMware ESXi server. This was a bargain server on eBay. It's got some L5640 uh, Xeon processors, 24 cores, tw or 12 cores, which is 24 threads, which is and 24 gigs of RAM. It's a pretty decent home lab server. Put some 7200 RPM, two terabyte drive SAS, and some bulk storage in SATA. We have an H700 in here. If you have not seen it, please check out my video on how to properly flash an H700. I promise you will love it, especially if you've ever fought with firmware or defective cards. So, what we got here is a LSI. Oh, uh, what is this thing? Oh. Uh, it's an LSI controller, but I can't remember specifically which RAID controller it is. Um, anyway, and it's not going to fit in, so we want to pull that out. And then we're going to take this out and just move it up. Oh well, one day. All right, we're gonna move it down here because it needs to go in a conventional port. It's not gonna play nice in the special little Dell port. All right, so once this is in, we'll just insert this little keeper back. And then we've got to plug these cables in. And uh, we've got a little bit more to do. We've got to pull out what's left of the battery. This is not a battery backed up unit. I am not ultra concerned about performance. Uh, there's nothing that I'm going to be doing that requires the kind of performance that a Um, the battery backed up right through cache requires. You know, this is just a VMware server and I'd actually rather it be more reliable but a little slower. So, the first thing we need to do is figure out which channel is one and which channel is two. Ports four through seven go here. So this is the B cable. And you don't want to force these, you just want to pop them in. And then we've got our A cable. These cables are really long. They came from eBay. They were about 20 bucks a piece. They took two thirds of forever to get here because the postal service is a hot mess. And the idiot postmaster we currently have is trying to destroy the post office. All right, so that's in there. Now we're going to put this back in, and this just drops in. You just want to watch your cables when you do it. And then this drops in. All right. And then that's just all trash. So then you just want to take these cables and just kind of tuck them in out of the way. And then you can put your lid back on. <clears throat> all right. So next, let's configure the server.